Hey guys, it's me Natalia. We are back to our collection of cards. It's part number three. If you didn't see part number one, number two, I will link in this video so you can check it out uh, first. And please subscribe if you're not yet. So let's see what we have. I'm sure we're not gonna cover <laughs> in this 20 minutes or 25 this uh, cards, but at least we can get as much as we can. So let's start. Here is an image by Chincha Cook, and it's a 3D image. Beautiful love butterflies, and here is the pretty puppy. Okay, I'm just gonna put them right on the back of this. Okay, so mostly of this cards is six by six. And this one as well has many, many layers. I like paper cut. Here's the cute flower. So I used to have a blog and I'm gonna ask you guys for a help. Maybe you can help me out. My blog was actually same as YouTube channel, except it has an S and an end, which is love, not an end actually, love crafts with the S forever. Love crafts forever. I don't know why I spelled that way, but here's some stitching in here. So I run that blog for my card making uh, design teams and after I didn't uh, craft for so many years I went back to my blog and I google it I still can see all my posts up there which is tons and tons of cards and I have some tutorials up there but as admin I can't get in into it. So when I click on, you know how it used to be a blogger button on the left side of the blog and you can go to your back side of your blog to post, to do whatever you have to do in the background. It redirected me to create new blog. So I don't know what happened and what to do because obviously I have a blog and I can't get to it. So right now I created new blog with um, WordPress and so far I posted up there just a one uh, one post it's gonna be for all the crafty stuff and everything I have another blog that I made with the blogger for my beauty channel which is Natalia XO you can check it out all the links on the side up there of my video but I really really want to get back to my uh, Love Crafts Forever blog and I can't. So if some of you know what to do, maybe you can help me in the comment section tell me what's the problem, why I can't get it into it. So guys, this is the spinner card. You see that? It's a penny on the other side in here. This is how it's made. It's kind of cute. It's fun for kids to make birthday cards like that. Okay, this one. I don't know. This <laughs> lace kind of too much, but it's kind of idea of the table with the lace and it, like you know the English tea party stuff. So just a regular circle card. And we love to camp and I think next year we're gonna go back camping we're gonna buy a trailer because our trailer was stolen unfortunately and we didn't go camp for a few years now so we kind of missed it it's lots of fun to sit by the bunk fire have a marshmallows here's some funky kids cards some cards is really really simple 
here's a looks like a whole bunch of in here why is it so bulky i can't even remember anymore that's a beads work is it focusing what's on the inside ah oh, okay so on the inside the hearts and i stitch around by hand lots of holes poking and stitching but Sometimes I like to put my heart to a card. Well, obviously you put hearts to each one. And this one, little one, what's on the inside? Some message, 3D message. So, kitoki. Next is a, I have a set of this uh, paper cardstock. Oh, I love all this vintage kind of look, unique. And it's like I make this digital image from Whoopsie Daisy. It's like she's showing this lady, come on, check me out. Look at this, my outfit. And here's some peekaboo butterflies. This butterfly charm. Another tear. It's kind of fun to do stuff like that. Make a card different and unique. Here's the simple bear playing in the snow. Okay, there is a card for boys, and as I say in my first video, I don't like too much to make a card for boys because I'm not good at it. I don't know, this card might look okay, but it's still, it's so hard. For girls it's easy, you know, glitter, sparkle, boom, done. For boys you have to kind of think about it. There's another dragon, that was my other... Uh, design team and do you like to play pool table pool oh boy I love play pool so much I used to oh actually it's this way card and or maybe this way this way and I used to play in leagues for the pool and a ladies team and then mixed team with boys and we used to go from bar to bar tournaments that was fun time but that was definitely before kids so me and my husband husband or I I should say always messed up English it's not easy guys and before kids we play lots of pool tournaments with lots of fun okay what we have here two cards I put two cards because I didn't have too many of this. I used to buy these envelopes in a dollar store, this clear plastic. And they are perfect for a 6x6 cards. But they don't have them anymore. I wish I could buy more before. Inside, some decorated, some not. And here's the kitty. Kitty cat. Love the swirls, those gems. Okay, last time I didn't pay attention. I got so excited showing you guys cards that I didn't realize the time was already up. So, of course, it chopped me. Chopped my video. This is 3D, 5D, whatever you want to say. All those paper cuts. And the other card on this side. Here is one more card, and here is the very tiny, tiny little card. What is this? Ah, okay, guys. This is the interesting card. So it's a very little, tiny one, and then you can kind of like a peekaboo from from message, and then you just. Close back and flop this back, and then you can put this on your table. <laughs> okay, you see that, right? All right, that's it. Well, I have lots of creative time years ago. Some cards are so old that I don't even remember I made them. 
here's another one yeah I didn't have enough storage uh, so I put two cards in one envelope if they are kind of more flat like class 3d it's only butterfly uh, butterfly in here so they fit two cards inside here is another Halloween cards and this one obviously sticker dry out because from dollar store and this fans okay I'm gonna show you guys you see that it's cut from Pepsi so it's a metal fans and then here is another Halloween and one more Halloween you see this kind of like a tear from the inside M&M &M, hiding from Halloweeners <laughs> I think it's kind of funny guys okay I don't know how many videos we're gonna have this is just a tag because I don't think we have enough time to go through half of this box it's a huge box This is just a more kind of simple cards and smaller size. Okay. Then I will later organize them. It's pretty flowers. From, I love this double um, color ribbons. They make a beautiful flowers. And it's a pretty gem on the inside. I have so many flowers already made, guys. I should do... Uh, video for your collection of my handmade flowers and maybe we can do some kind of like a giveaway I don't know because I have a huge box of pre-made flowers already here's the little this is just like a first of my cards that's why they look so simple and so little I was practicing with all the embossing they are cute but there's nothing really special about them just the simple cards Easter card thank you card image by Magnolia I don't really like these images I don't like that they don't have a face so like no nose no mouth I don't know I don't understand this but that was a gift image so I color it okay next Easter with the Easter bunny up there. Easter, Easter. Here is the ballerina dancing on the stage. I made it with the K for Catherine. Here is another baby card for a boy. Pansy. My mom's favorite flowers, I think. Here is some card by Kenny. Who remember those images? I don't even know if they still making them. This one pretty card. I like this one, so I'm gonna show you. Um, I'm gonna pull out of the bag. And I love kind of this black and white. Looks pretty with the vintage back around and I decorated pretty on the inside it's like mother and daughter and this says a mother's love is purest form of praise for her children I like this sentence so yeah it has a charm I love this card it's one of my favorites okay how much 14 minutes so far we still going maybe at least one row here is another here is the pretty pretty card that I make for design team at Sweet Pea Stamps here you can see the de details and then we're gonna open hold on something something stuck okay now we open this way and look at this 3d image with the 
dress and then we open this flaps has like a double flaps I spent so much time creating this card and then in here I have a oh, I'm making a shadow I have a tag One of my favorite fairy image. I have a lot on this card. And here's the saying. You can pass and read it. But I love it. So this card took me a long time to make. But I treasure this card. I love it. And it's like it's so many details in here. Okay. Okay, and now the sentence came out. I have to re-glue it. That's what happened when you're using the dollar stuff, those foam stickers, guys. They are not good quality, so I don't suggest you to use um, because after years they just not sticky anymore. Pro bright. Okay, what's in here? Some silly card again with the pull tabs. And there it is. I hope you can see good guys because when I'm looking at the camera, it's kind of I don't see all the details, uh, but you probably see better than I do right now. There's the puppy flower from Organza. I need a more room on the table. Okay, here is another one card for a man, hockey lover, has an arrow with the coarse light from the beer can. <laughs> pull tab that I embossed is the braid and there's another card on this side for a country girl this guitar another one with pansy flowers here's the cute angel and I embossed this is the vellum it's kind of hard to do if you do this is embossed with the embossing folder and if you push too hard it will tear holes in it so you have to be very careful when you do that oh the beach I don't want a summer go <laughs> okay here this another vintage lady card Okay, we're almost done for the first row here. There's the Betty Boos. Who collect them? I know lots of girls like to collect Betty Boo. Okay, this is the... Okay, what's going on here? This is, looks like bulky because I made an envelope for it. What's on the inside? Ah, okay, so this is 3D standing card. Happy birthday. This one, same thing, has an envelope. I tried to do as many envelope matching for the cards, but this one for the girls who love purses. This is the shape of the purse, and you can see the purse a bunch of this 3D flowers very simple card has an envelope as well I like that few with envelopes, good girl I like a combination of uh, brown and kind of ocean color tail Nice combination of these colors. 
Okay, here's another one. Felt fence, not a fence, foam, cut from foam, just die cuts. Okay, I think we have maybe five more minutes. Here's the dragon. This one. I love these mushrooms. And I went to Ukraine this summer and in the woods I found, I took some pictures, look at it. It's like a, I embossed and make a double cut papers, flowers. I embossed and they are so pretty. I love this card. I don't think I decorated on the inside. Here is another funny card for a boy with the chain robot. This is nice range like a metal um, charm. Some buttons. cute dragons <laughs> it's not it's a circle card well let's oh! okay sorry guys my card just hit camera the thing didn't fall okay there's on the inside easel card Make a wish. Make a wish. Okay, this card. One of my favorites as well. I spend so much time just to color this image. And then you can see stitching with the beads. image I color with inks there is another 5d image all the paper cut I love to hold the scissors in my hands that's a stampin up uh, stamp that I embossed in different embossing powder. You see that? Color of the rainbow kind of achieved. This is for a baby. Sleeping baby. Garden and the snails. Butterfly Fairy Another Dragon Making a Sandcastle 